How many do that in a year? Sorry, I didn't get that. The internet isn't reachable. Hello and welcome to my channel. So today we are going to be looking at how to solve that exact problem. So if you constantly get the error, sorry I didn't get that, the internet is unreachable. When you are working with your Alexa or your Echo Dot, that is what we are going to be looking at today. And you are going to be looking at three different ways that you could possibly resolve that problem. So the first thing that you want to do is to check your internet connection. So for me, I'm using the Orimo MiFi, which is what I have here. And from the display on the upper part of the MiFi, I can be able to determine whether my internet is on or if there's an issue. So when my internet is on and it's okay, it will be green. Yeah, so it's okay. Aside from checking your internet connection on your MiFi or your phone or router or whatever else you're using, uh, the next thing you should try to do is to check whether the internet is working on any other device. So if you've also connected the internet on another device, say your phone or a laptop, you should also check if the internet is working on that device. So for me, I'm also using the same internet connection on my phone uh, and it's working properly. It's what I've indicated as OR. So aside from ensuring that the internet connection is working on other devices, the next thing you want to do is to check whether the device, now the Echo Dot, is connected to your internet through the app. Now, if you have downloaded the app on your phone, uh, this is the app I'm talking about, Amazon. Uh -huh. So when you open the app, uh, just go to the home page, home, and then under favorites, you'll be able to see your device if you had already connected your device. So that's my device. And uh, now this is the page that you will get. The next thing you want to do is go to settings. So when you go to settings, you'll be able to see different things. At the name of your device, you can change the name, audio settings, Bluetooth devices, and then Wi-Fi network. So it's also connected to the same Wi-Fi network that my phone is connected to. OR, OR. So that indicates that the Echo Dot is connected to the internet. So if you notice that your internet is working fine and your device is also connected to the internet, the third option that you can consider is checking your router. Now this is an option that I found on the Amazon UK forum. The person who had commented in the community forum had stated that you should go into the router settings and split the two bands that you will see there, the 2.4 gigahertz and the 5 gigahertz by renaming the 5 gigahertz band. So after renaming the 5 gigahertz, you're supposed to switch off your device, that is the router device, uh, and then setting it up again. If the first two solutions do not work for you, uh, you can try that one out. For me, when I checked my router settings, I could only see the 2.4 gigahertz band. Yeah, uh, I couldn't see the 5 gigahertz band. So if you can see clearly here, uh, band selection 2.4 gigahertz. So if you're going to try that option, just check. Check what your provider has or what your internet provider offers. And if it works, let me know in the comments below. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comment section below. And we can try to brainstorm it together. Have a lovely day. Bye-bye.